guys, welcome back to another video, and I want to apologize for not uploading today. Um, look, so SmackDown, I will be reviewing SmackDown Monday. I just need some time to just get some stuff on my plate and all that stuff. I just need to clear my head. So these will be the two videos. So this, I will be doing another. I might be doing a SmackDown re uh, review today. You never know, but. Um, until then, you just gotta wait for a SmackDown review. It wasn't really that good, but, uh, spoiler alert, but I'm gonna tell you, but I'm gonna just show you what I, but they, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna, I'm just say the ending was good, but the show, the rest of the show, <sighs> um, it's one match I, I left out. It's two things, it's two topics I, I, I just, that's, um, that I wonder, in it, it, that I wanna bring up. It's, a match that I left out on my predictions and the um a gimmick a gimmick match that's uh that uh the fiend and Randy will be in tonight. So here we go. So so now my prediction on Nia Jax, Nia Botch versus Shayna Baszler and Oscar versus Oscar. Now, it is, I, this is the only th two I am picking from this uh, whole, um, so like it, so Asuka's about to get a mystery partner, so it's not going to be Lana because she was injured on Monday, last Monday, so I, agree, I think it will be A, Charlotte, B, Dana Brooke, or freaking, um, Mandy Rose. Or my or I or Kyrie Sane or Kyrie Sane, but most likely is either going to be Charlotte or Dana or freaking uh or Mandy Rose. I don't see it being a freaking I don't see it being a freaking uh a return uh freaking a return. I would love to see Kyrie Sane come back and win those titles, but I don't I really don't care about this match. I can care less about this match. The only person I care about in this match. It's Asuka and Shayna, even though... Why does the tag team titles even exist? The tag team titles need to be burned to a crisp. They don't even know how to freaking uh build that women's... They don't even know how to build that women's division or their tag team division. Why is they um putting in a tag team title for the, uh, for the women, even though it's not even a lot of tag teams? So, that's stupid. But going on to this another, on to this next topic. So, the Fiend and Randy will be taking place in a Firefly Funhouse Inferno match. I hope it won't be the Ring of Fire. Remember that Ring of Fire match in twenty? I think it was twenty thirteen. I guess when well, I think that was the first match on the card. It was um the well the kickoff match the kickoff match. The uh the, the match that kicked off uh SummerSlam, and it was Kane versus uh what's come, and then it got screwed up by uh it it was stupid it was just stupid, um but I hope this match be like um be like the one that they ha uh they had at Armageddon when MVP fought Kane remember that, um I hope it be like that I hope it just don't be no boring ass PG ass freaking. Inferno match. So that's my thoughts on this whole situation. Give me y'all thoughts. What do you guys think about this? I'll see you guys next time. For my SmackDown review in my in my freaking um my TLC review. So I'll see y'all guys later. I love you guys. Um, take care of yourselves, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.